All right, if you're following along with one of our ropes tutorials and you think your render should be looking like this, but instead you hit play and everything explodes like this, um, hopefully this video will help you out. Uh, there's been a pretty big change between the uh, latest versions here of Cinema 4D that may affect following along with those tutorials and it's a pretty quick fix. So let's fix this right now. So uh, when you're following along, I'm gonna have you make a helix and I think the default helix has 50 subdivisions and uh, we used to need a lot more subdivisions. And it seems that with uh, 2024 and maybe moving forward, you're just gonna need less. So here's the fix. Uh, I'm just gonna search for all my helixes so I could just select them all at once. And I'm gonna switch this subdivision from ten, uh, 50 to 10. And let's back up and hit play. And right away we get a much more stable result. Ooh, however, they get un unhooked. <laughs> Beautiful, but not the result we want. So it looks like uh, we will have to reconnect our little square here. So let's do that. Uh, let's go to our cube and go to our connector. And if we update the radius, we should be about right there. So let's hit play. Now we get our curlies. Oh, here we go. All right, of course, we gotta zoom in and do a quick render. Um, oh, much, much better. Boom, done. I think we're in focus. Yeah, that'll work. Um, hopefully that helps. And uh, while we're here, let's grab a, a new rope material. I think there's too much red going on here. Uh, I'm gonna go into Grayscale Gorilla Studio and type in paracord. And let's grab something a little bit brighter. I'm gonna download this blue one and this pink one. And I'm gonna send it to Cinema 4D. And let's replace this coral one and this kind of brownish one. Where's this? Good? Yeah, let's replace that one with blue. And see if we get anything a little bit brighter. Maybe something down here. Oh, there we go, folks. All right, hopefully that helps. Let me know if anything else is broken. Thanks for all the comments uh, to let me know these things so we could dig in and make little videos like this to help you out. Uh, thanks as always, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, everyone.